Hello everyone, welcome back to Harvest Moon Back to Nature. We have an interesting week, so let's start doing it now, so that way I don't, you know, completely forget. Good boy, Boris. So today is the sheep festival, and tomorrow is our wedding. So let's do this. Can you imagine if I'm doing this on that recording? Oh, I would laugh. Yams are ready. And I think strawberries are ready too, but I could be wrong. Let's see. Indeed. Okay, so we have a full day ahead of us. I'm not gonna bother watering anything because the hot spikes will take care of that. So let's work on everything else. Hello, Pony. Hopefully these guys can give me the time. Uh, they kind of look like they get to give me an easy time, but no. I almost couldn't do that. No, oh, wrong one. Wrong cow. Because I have a feeling this cow's gonna go and ruin my whole entire day. There we go. Yeah, they were quite nice to me today. Hmm. Maybe they know I can't take care of them tomorrow. They're trying to be awfully nice to me. I have to check on that sheep that's leaving and this cow. You're good. As well as you. Alright, so let's feed everybody. I'm quite surprised that everything went so well. Better in the rucksack than on the floor. Ah! Ooh! Excuse me. Thank you. Oh, my hand hurts. I was playing Overwatch before I started recording, and I had to like finish up the commission. So it's like, ugh. Nope, I need that. Plus, I need to start going to bed early. Like, not that I have any, like, extravagant news about a job, but because I am hurting myself. <laughs> By hurting myself, I mean, I've just come to the point where, like, as nocturnal as I am, staying up to, like, 5 o'clock in the morning just to wake up to walk my dog. Just so, and by waking him up, I mean, walk him, I mean, like, oh, I slept for two hours, it's time to walk my dog. It's tiring. And my body's ha body has had enough. 
and quite frankly, I don't blame it. So I will be, hopefully, fixing a sleep schedule for myself because my body cannot continue. I mean, it helps to at least, you know, usually after I finish recording and as I'm editing, I'm playing Overwatch until it's done. Uh-oh, hold on. Uh, let me make sure everything's still on. Yep, sorry everybody. I had to stay here! Alright. Oh, that's cheese already. Nope. 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 Yes. Yes, that's three. Four. And five. Alright, now we go. No, I wanna do this. Not from this angle. Alright, I'll just do it elsewhere then. Oh no! Oh no! <laughs> no! Go back! Okay, hey, 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 come on, come on, come on, come on, go back, go back, go back in, how did I not notice you? And I don't have the, um, bell, so I can't direct, okay, this should be good. Thank goodness. That wasted my time. Let's get some of these inside the farmhouse. So I'll do the other half a little bit later. Mm -hmm. I can't forget about these guys. The mayonnaise. I gotta take all the ones I'm making into mayonnaise right now. Now we're gonna work on harvesting and bringing items up that to the house, which is really just the strawberries.
right, that's... Properly at 12, I'll go ahead and um, head to the festival no matter what. I do just want to get these all done with just so that I have something to have. I'll leave this three. Yeah. I'll leave this three until later tonight. Oh, no. Grab you. Put you down. Yeah, Alright. Um, I think they should be done. Yeah. So tomorrow's their last day. That means on. Ah, I actually can't hire them until Monday. That's fine. That just means I have to do one day. No, two days alone. Okay. No, I can hire them on Saturday. I'm, I'm silly. Sorry, guys. I can't wait for Stay to get faster, like his brothers. like the fall music for this game. Okay. So, I know I said around 12 I would go to the festival. However, I do want to at least get this batch done. So let's work on that first before I go to any festival. Like, it's no big deal to leave the three strawberries that are going to go in my inventory. That's weird. Um, hello? But for this, it's like a different story. I just want to get these out and into the shipping bin. carrots here. I'll figure that out when uh when I come back from the festival. So at least when the festival's over I'll be in my house so I can check my inventory. My inventory yeah my inventory my fridge is inventory. No.
Oh, how cute. I know she said it before, but it doesn't matter. I'm ready to win. Yes, I have. I think it's to keep the main and bar a little bit close together. She's so good, I love her. Alright, let's check my fridge. That's why. Alright, so let's go get those last few carrots and then the last few strawberries. Can I ship a hundred strawberries yet? Not yet. Okay. Oh, I got scared. I saw a harvest sprite. I'm like, all right. I need to do a head count. Have one, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. 13, 14. Fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen. Okay, all right, yeah, yeah, all right. Might have to go up and down my farm. Then again, um, so long as I don't hear like a dog barking. There shouldn't be any animal. Uh, uh, that should be a clear sign that, like, hey, there's no animals here. Like, I'll definitely hear it when I go into the. That's me. The hot house and then leave it. If I hear it, um, I'll have to find out where. The sheep is while also making sure um, the dog doesn't get my animal. After the next strawberry harvest, I am going to cut them down and put something else there. However, for now, let us go and get married. Hmm? I am so sorry, everyone. My tea went down my, the wrong pipe. Ooh, it's raining tomorrow. That means I don't have to do work at all. But I guess it happens when I leave the house? Alright, let's see. Alright, let's do this. I know it happened like as soon as I woke up. Huh?
Oh. Are you telling me that nothing's gonna happen because it's my birthday? I didn't even know today was my birthday. Also, no animals died, so that's a sign that there was no animals outside. Really not going to get like married today because it's my birthday? I forgot it was even my birthday. I hate how those sheep are all up in the corner. There's just only like, three of them, but that's still three too many. Like, spread out, ladies. For some reason, I got terrified. I thought there was a skull. That means that she was sick. <clears throat> it's so weird that I can't get married because it's my birthday. my tea. Like, I was afraid I wasn't going to be able to mute the mic fast enough. Like, I'm so sorry. Mm -hmm. Honestly, if I remembered that the 22nd was my birthday, I wouldn't have to post the Karen on her birthday. No good deed goes unpunished. <laughs> Alright. Let's milk everybody. Hey! What did it say? <laughs> I may need to swallow some water. Just to get this last curdle of cheese, cheese, <laughs> of tea to get away from my throat. <clears> throat. Oh boy! I've never choked that badly from tea before. Don't know what happened, but okay. Imagine. Oh, I got scared. Did 
Did I really lose track of which cow I didn't do yet? I did. There we go. Oh yeah, most of the cows are all giving me um, large milk now. That's always a good sign. And technically, I already made one of the cheese, so there we go. Fluffy's such a winner. I love her. Take some of it for now. Also, I made friends with a lot of villagers. Like, you would think they would get give me more happy birthdays. Oh my gosh, this is silly. I mean, our, our um, Wedding will forever be known as that one wedding where it rained. Did you know that when it rains, it means a witch and it's sunny outside, a witch is getting married? <laughs> when I went to a wedding with my coworker, I told him that, and a few of his friends as well. And they're like, well, now we know what, what she is. And it was so funny, because usually when you go to a wedding, um, the groom is given a, um, someone's given a chance to like, object the wedding and whatnot. No, not this wedding. This wedding wasn't about, um, objections to, to the match at all. I'm like, did anyone else notice that? That, like, there was not a chance to have, like, any objections to why these two shouldn't be married? And, you know, it was actually a fun time. I, I didn't know anyone who was there except for my coworker. But it was fun. It was a lot of fun. I met some of his friends. They were cool and nice and sweet. But yeah. Just saying. She's, she's a witch! It rained. It was sunny out. She's a witch! feel like going to bed early. The simple fact that, like, I was robbed in my wedding. Oh, I should have brought this closer. Oh, wait, I was actually putting it all directly in, wasn't I? Oh. I didn't say you weren't, buddy. You're doing good. I'm proud of you. I'm proud of you, don't worry about it. I, I'm just not even trying to talk to you guys and belittle you. I'm trying to grab the egg pants. Dave's the only one who's like going so slowly. But like, I know I mentioned it in like the past two episodes. 
But like, if you look closely at them, each one of them are moving at its own pace. Like, the ones I've asked for help the most are moving faster than the others. And everyone's moving faster than Stade because, well, we all know Stade wasn't around much. Did Karen hold off our wedding just so that um, I can have a birthday? Karen, please! Marry me already! Today was meant to be our day! This is so weird! <clears throat> I didn't know that if... Um... If you... If it's your birthday... You... Not have the wedding ceremony yet? Really weird. He says, I don't know. I just realized it's March. Yay! I have an appointment today at 12.45. My gosh. Also, tomorrow is Voltron Season 5. I'm gonna try to record early that day so that I don't miss it. Sorry, guys. I have a love. And my love is Shiro and Voltron. Don't look at me. Oh. I wonder if the Harvest Moon Kia knows about this. That like, if you don't, like, if you schedule a marriage, a wedding ceremony on your birthday, it won't happen. Hmm. Care of use myself. And I guess I can go and clean up the fields. I don't know what to do. But say, there's no way that didn't get hit. I don't think I'm gonna get the yellow one. Yeah, I figured. Oop. Hello, you. wrap my head around it like I pretty much cut that um, harvest by head off essentially Married now, like it 
It literally makes no sense, but whatever. I'm gonna do it, I guess. Special birthday dinner, even though I'm not married yet. Oh, I thought an event was gonna happen. I was gonna be like, what? By a special event birthday dinner, I mean some like Karen, even though we're not married, at the like six. So, might as well just do this. I really don't wanna go do my inventory finding the sickle and all that jazz. Now let's get married. Please? There we go. Oh, no pretty music. Hi, darling. Beautiful. I love you. And now we can start our life together. Aww. I was about to say to you. Ah! Kick my dog out of the house? I hope not. Wait, stop it. Ah! My dog will be smart. Ah! Well, he'll try to be smart. Oh, cool. Right. Um. No, I have. To. See, look, they changed it. Alright, so the 23rd, right after my birthday, is our wedding. Wait, I can ask the Harvest Spice to help tomorrow. Nothing! Alright, let's work on getting some of these out. Um, I was going to ask the Harvest Spice for help tomorrow, since it's really just raining. However, I thought how it wouldn't work because we wouldn't have crops that would be ready to harvest. And then I remembered the harvest that would need to be watered. And then I remembered the crops in um, the hothouse. And I can't ask them for help today without giving them a gift. I just can't do that. I'm trying to be nice to them. They're working hard for me. Maybe I can go and say hi to them. And you know what? I think I'm actually gonna give a gift to the Harvest Goddess. We'll give her a yeah. First, let's work on this. Or at least chip away at it. There's a lot. A lot, a lot. Yeah, this episode feels a little quick. Just because of all that's happened. Set it up for next time. 
Alright, let's take care of my babies. Hopefully this will go smoothly. Why are you blocking the door? Oh, thank goodness. Maybe I have a chance. There you go. That's what I like to see. Guys? Please? Alright. Oh, nice. I like this. Last cow, and everyone's in my way. Okay, there we go. Okay, I didn't want both of them moving, I just needed one of them to move. But now you'll know who's moved and who's not. No? Okay, but I still need to take care of one of you cows. of this sheep wasn't up. Oh, they're all done. Alright. Let's feed everybody. Oh boy. I figured you guys would take over the feeders. Never giving me a break. I used to make I bleh. I used to play a game with myself where if I see saw a cow coming towards me, I would try and fill up my rucksack before he showed up, but never won. I saw he's so fast I could put items in my inventory before they come swarming me as if demanding the food right then and there. Like, please feed me now I'm starving. All four of my stomachs. Every day has six. I have my phone on me, and I could check it to fact check things, but I am tired. And also, I, I don't want to. I'll be honest, I really just don't want to check it. It's four or six, it's one of those two. Maybe they have ten. No, it's like four. Wait, what am I doing? Here I am, ready to buy and get more feed, but... Wait, what?
Huh? Oh, right. Um, because I technically couldn't take care of them yesterday, I'm not getting anything from them. I think that's ridiculous. Like, if they ask me before a festival if my work is done, you would think they would ask me before my own wedding. Don't you dare! If, like, if I wanted to get my work done before I got married. Just saying. That would make sense. But whatever, it's a Harvest Moon game. Which, by the way, I might as well mention it. I mentioned in Rogue the Snow's um, group chat that the creators of Story of Season, even though people are still calling it Harvest Moon, but basically the Bokujo Monogiri series. Wait. No, I said this already. About the dragon thing. Yeah. Because I vaguely remember saying, I like dragons. So, yeah, I'm not mentioning this again. Almost did! But no, I remembered because I'm a good needle. Or I try to be. My gosh, I still gotta water all this stuff. I'm done. With fall. Like, I don't even want this stuff to be here anymore. I'll be perfectly honest. Like, just, just get it out of here. But soon, in the next episode, I'll be cutting some of it down. Pretty much when the 30th rolls around, so in the next episode, you won't have to worry about all this anymore. I'm so happy! Hey guys, I know you haven't eaten all day because I was busy getting married, but hi, how are you guys? I think that's so silly. I don't know how it works in newer games now. I forgot how it happened in the new beginning. Also because I only married one person and that was Michelle. Oh my gosh, I just remembered something. So, occasionally I do like to dabble in drawing. And... One day, I, I, I haven't been on DeviantArt in like months. Like, months. I have over a thousand notifications that I'll probably never chip away at. But, I... Well, I guess I can make it different. I can sign in on a different phone, I guess. But anywho, um... Let me say I'm so good. I was going with this. I had a point. What was I talking about? Right. So I meant I did one day draw Michelle, who's a, a bachelorette in A New Beginning. This was the last game that Sumi did before uh, Marvelous went with XZ to localize their game. Someone commented about how not everyone, like, oh my gosh. It was something like crude, I guess. Not crude, but rude about the Bachelorette. Don't get me wrong, when Michelle is actually not the best Bachelorette. She actually admits to being um, devious and manipulating of people. She, she doesn't hesitate to admit to that. But no matter what, I still like her. I love her character. I love her design. That's sometimes what I go for. I go for their character design for... Um, I've noticed, I go for bachelorette design, like how they look and how they act, but for my bachelor, my bachelors, I have to see if they follow an aesthetic, I guess you should say. Like, I, I totally married Lon, Kurt, that stoic type. I think Wayne is the only one who's a little bit different, but... But my girls always how they look, and Iris was definitely a pretty, pretty girl. And so was Michelle, so I married her, no questions asked. And, yeah, so they were, like, concerned, like, would you really date someone like that in real life? And, like, uh, no. I wouldn't date someone in real life or marry someone who was like Michelle in real life, because that's the beauty 
of the Harvest Moon Story of Seasons games that you could go ahead and marry people who you never usually would marry. Like, I had a friend tell me once that, like, I feel like if Vaughn was a real person, you would probably date and marry someone just like him. And part of me is like, yeah, I, I probably would. And the other half of me is like, not really. Like, it's the aesthetic, and he was a cowboy. He was wearing all black. He had an aesthetic, and I loved him. But yeah, so that's what the beauty of this game series is. I have the water thing still. That you can marry whoever you want, regardless of what and who they are, really. Like, there are people who marry the Kappa, and yet I'm being judged for marrying Michelle. Like, I think not, go away. Not that, but like, those who are judging me for marrying Michelle, but don't judge the people who marry the Kappa, then I don't want to hear it. I do not want to hear it. Oh, I was supposed to give one to the Harpers Goddess. <laughs> Hello. Oh, I got so done with this. And I still gotta take care of the hot house. Okay, I'll stop because I know I don't have enough. I was supposed to stop before I watered that last one. Oh no, ha 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 ha. Nice. I thought I still had carrots. Let's go take care of the strawberries. My gosh, it's not even 2 o'clock yet, and I'm already tired. Let's go to the next day. I love her. <gasps> I love her. I love her so much. Let's go make a diary entry. It's raining though, but I love you. I love her. But yeah, like, Karen had that hairstyle I love, so it's like, aesthetic. Gosh darn it, Boris! Get the ball! Oh. There, my love. Oh, oh Boris. Actually, Oh, you do this. Good, you didn't get it. Go after it either. Alright, let's start the farm stuff. Does no one want to say, like, congrats on your marriage? Like... Alright, let's do this. Hello, baby. No, 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 don't go too far.
At least none of my cows and sheep hate me for not feeding them for a day. It's like they understand. We know you were at a wedding. You were getting married. It's okay. We stay on you. Like when you step on your dog's foot. Only, you know, in this scenario, the dog is like 30 animals that starve for the day. It's actually quite gruesome and sad when you think about it. I'm sorry for everyone who had to hear that soft, soft, dark thought of mine. Soft. Uh, well, I cannot speak today. He blames it on the entire. Which, eh, no. I think, like, staying up all night and then waking up and then being unable to sleep, then waking up again, it started to take its toll on me. It's just time to stop that. Like, it just doesn't feel like it's enough sleep. Okay, where you do it? <laughs> Here we go. Feed everybody. Everybody. Oh my gosh, I really hope a sheep isn't outside. Alright. How did look, everybody? I was actually going to be afraid, like... Keeping an eye on the ones I didn't do. Did actually some of them lose affection? I mean, if they did, totally understandable. Like, alright, 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 yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, I was gone all day. Did it feed them? Yeah, I think they did. I'm, I'm back to like just getting five large milk. Yeah. Wow, you would think they would not do that to me, I guess. Like, this, like I guess I did lose affection for not showing up for a day to feed them to get married. They'll be back to normal tomorrow, hopefully. If not, it's cool, it's understandable. Really? I'm busy. Alright. I 
have no idea what we're gonna do today because we got all of this free time with our fish counter. Let's get one more. I feel like just cutting this down now. So I don't have to deal with it for the next episode, but I'll I, I won't. I'll keep hold of it. Fair chickens, that's fair. I'll just feed you and be on my way. I got in at 8 o'clock last time. Can I do it again? Yes, I can. Yes. I'm so glad you did. Do you guys, are you guys not interested in how Karen's doing? Alright, let's get some flour. Here's the fifth one. Let's go ask the Harvest Bunch for help. I'm gonna be upset if I can't, even though the hot house hasn't been watered yet. Oops, sticking though. You have a dark past about you. I don't know what it is, but you got something. You're keeping secrets. I'm watching you. Not yet. Let me in. There we go. I need you guys to help me work. Alright. 
Okay, Yahoo! Then you. Oh, I was supposed to ask him for help right away. That's whatever. I'll take care of that another time. Yeah, that's good. You're welcome. Nice, it works. Thank you. Sorry, I, I had a brain fart. Like, I'm just, I'm literally reading what they're saying, and my mind's drifting elsewhere. Like, honestly, if I could have him cook for me, that'd be great. That way he can raise up my recipes and stuff. I really try. I'm trying to figure out what we can do. I really hope we're just kind to us so that this doesn't go belly up. Alright, um, sure, we'll cut down some lumber. Just in case this does get destroyed, I want to be prepared. Trading takes like a whole bunch of lumber. <laughs> I could look it up, but I'm not going to bother with that today. Sorry, guys. I don't know why that song to my head. It's not like it's a, fish, it's a song of anything. It's like a fan-made song. It's a show. This truffle. Mm -hmm, mm 
What did I say? What happened? Definitely, when the new year starts, I would like to start collecting more herbs and shipping them out so I can unlock the medicine. What I really wish would happen in this game was that the villagers would have children. Like, I'm well aware in HM64 that when um, the rivals in the Bachelorette get married, they have children of their own. And I wish that happened in this game, but I played like 10 years in the Harper's Moon game and in this game and nothing, I've never seen anyone have a child. I didn't get married, no children though. Alright, let's ship it. I do want to come back for a flower. I'm gonna put it in the the vase. Make it make it nice and bright for Karen. That happened way too slow. That worried me a little bit. In the box. I just want to do it now so I don't forget. Oh, uh, is she here cooking? Did she mention she's cooking? I love her. Oh, wait a minute. She can't cook. Yeah, just keep not deciding, honey. There we go. Brian's up the room, I think. But yeah, don't, don't cook me anything, honey. It's, it's okay, I'll cook you food. You don't need to cook me anything. Just stand there and be pretty. Oh, look at Karen right there. Um, I didn't, there we go. I wanted to see what our home was at. 3.35. Do it! Let me... I'm gonna get her a gift. A nice thank you for marrying me. Yeah. Is he not? I didn't know I was giving it to him as a gift. Oh, cry. What a waste. Um, he closes at four. I think I can make it. He's right down the road. No, he's not. <laughs> I didn't okay. Oh, cool, I got the recipe for pickled turnips. Why would you put sugar in pickled turnips, though?
Mr. Gill's present. Alright, now Karen's gonna have a gift. And now, I simply wait. I mean, I guess I could cut things down, but... How dare you. Oh, never mind. We ain't doing any of that. We're actually gonna go over here and wait so we can jump into the hot spring. Because I'm foolish. Very, very foolish of me. How could I do that to myself? Like, how? Foolish me. Foolish, foolish, foolish. <laughs> Come on, Zach. Take my stuff so I can go. Alright, let's go into the hot springs for a bit. Alright. Hop in, buddy. Six dirty, I'll take you out. Okay, yeah, yeah. That's time. Alright, that's it for this episode, guys. Um, I, it feels shorter than usual. Maybe it's not. I don't know. But, as usual, it's wonderful to always play with you guys. And we got married. That's the happy part. We got married to Karen, and I love Karen. Robin shows that when he wants to go to bed. Don't blame him. But, as per the usual, thank you for tuning in, thank you so much for listening to me rant and rave, and I'll see you in the next episode. Take care now.